With skyrocketing numbers of opioid overdoses and deaths, public health experts and communities nationwide have tried to develop programs to distribute Narcan to reverse the effects of an overdose. Now Marty Salt has more than a novel program that, according to the numbers, may be working. In 2020, 44 Americans died every day from a prescription opioid overdose, 16,000 in one year. 100,000 Americans died from illegal or street opioids like fentanyl last year alone. Now, a new program designed to provide help. It is a fully anonymous process. Researchers at the University of Cincinnati paired with the nonprofit group Caracol to provide supplies for what they call harm reduction vending machines. Safer injection kits. Um, injectable naloxone and nasal naloxone. Those and more all readily accessible in a secure machine that resembles a vending machine. People call a number to get a code to access supplies. Bachmeyer and Arendt know to some it may feel counterintuitive to provide free naloxone and fentanyl test strips to people struggling with addiction. But we do not believe that providing supplies to keep people safe, to keep people from overdosing, and to keep people from contracting infectious diseases enables them in any way. The vending machine has been operational for two years. More than 1,000 people have used it, and researchers say it's contributing to a decrease in overdose deaths in Cincinnati and the surrounding area. It's again important to recognize nationwide up 15 percent preliminary for us down 10 percent. A bright spot in an otherwise sobering health epidemic. Marty Salt, 16 News Now. And advocates say the harm reduction program that keeps the supplies locked but within reach may eliminate any fear of arrest. Bachmeyer says many other groups nationwide have already contacted them to learn more about their program. We'll be right back. Stay with us.